When it comes to unleashing the power of teacher leaders, Avondale Elementary School District just west of Phoenix, Arizona shows what can happen when a dedicated superintendent builds capacity among her ranks and creates a sense of family among the community she serves. Avondale Elementary School District is located just outside of Phoenix, and we serve approximately 6,000 students pre-K to eighth grade. We are a very diverse district, and many of our students, in fact, 74% of our students are eligible for free and reduced price meals. NIU team came into the Avondale School District in 2011 through a TIF grant with partnering with Arizona State University. Avondale Elementary School District serves nine schools, one alternative school, and all of our schools are A or B rated. We have one site that is a specialized early learning center and that's Laddie Core. And so while they're ineligible for earning a letter grade with our state, they do phenomenal things with our students. There's no doubt in our mind that NIAT is the foundation of those successes. The journey with National Institute for Excellence in Teaching has been one of self-discovery, one of reflection, and one of transformation. Michael Anderson was a C school. We implemented all the pieces of the rubric, but it was a growth piece. We got to a place where we knew this was going to be the year and we were 0.46 away from an A letter grade. And then COVID hit. We came back, tested again, and we were 1.6 tenth of a point away from being a, an A letter grade. And then we came back with a vengeance after goal setting with students. We adopted a growth mindset. We continued that growth, and I'm happy to say we've achieved that A status this year, and that's an immense feeling of pride. I totally believe people will do anything, no matter how hard it is, as long as the results are there. That's learning, right? I do better when I know better. One of the most recent successes is the state designated Avondale as an A-rated school district in 2023, which is the first year that the state actually assigned school uh, district ratings. There's a really strong collective efficacy here um, between the principals, assistant principals, teachers. We have a lot of opportunities to collaborate as an entire district. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to our maps. Dr. Hargrove's ability to bring us all together in a lot of different ways has made our transformation into a better school district and all of our schools seamless. In MAPS, which is master teachers, assistant principals, and principals, we work together every other week to come and develop our learning together. So no matter what school site you're at, we're all growing together. After our MAPS meetings, we have an opportunity to meet with our principal to further refine and solidify the direction that we're going. I would say Betsy's the ultimate teacher leader. Welcome back, AESD listeners. Dr. Hargrove does podcasts pretty much on a weekly basis. We have an app. She uses every avenue that she can to get the word out about the Avondale Elementary School District. What they've accomplished is they've built up their community. When school systems change to meet the needs of the employees and the families and the students, it changes the community in the long run and that's what's been done here. And they continue to do it over and over again. I know with every ounce of who I am that our children can do absolutely anything they put their minds to. That limitless future, it's not just words. That is our mission, to make sure that they have that limitless future. We have that power to do that, they have that power to do that, and we are not going to stop until it happens. I truly believe There is no better place for children or adults than Avondale Elementary School District. <laughs>